Assalamu alaikum everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to show you two ways to transfer WhatsApp from Android to iPhone for free. With these two methods, you can transfer all your WhatsApp messages with all the attachments from your Android phone to your iPhone. So make sure to watch the video till the very end. It will take only a few minutes of your time. But believe me, you will learn something new out of this video. And also, if you find this video helpful by any means, then please give it a thumbs up and also share the video with your friends. Sharing is always free guys. It doesn't cost you anything. So with that said, Let's get started. Our first method is using Move to iOS app to transfer WhatsApp from Android to iPhone. For this method to work, you don't have to use any kind of computer, any kind of data cable or something like that. This method is 100% free. However, you have to erase your iPhone in order to transfer WhatsApp from your Android phone. And also, your iPhone must be running on iOS version 15.5 or above. Now let me show you how this method works. Okay, in order to transfer WhatsApp using Move to iOS app, first of all install beta version of WhatsApp on your Android device. Just go to Google and search WhatsApp beta APK and install beta version of WhatsApp from any website you want. After installing it, now the second thing you have to do is download Move to iOS app on your Android device. That's all you have to do on your Android phone. On your iPhone, go to settings, go to general and make sure your iPhone is running on iOS version 15.5 or above. As you can see, my iPhone is already updated. In your case, if the update is available, just install it. After that, erase your iPhone by going to settings, going to general and scroll all the way down. Select transfer or reset iPhone. Select erase content and settings. Tap continue. Type your iPhone passcode, type your Apple ID password. Next, select erase iPhone and wait for your iPhone to restart. Once your iPhone is restarted, just go through the setup process. After going through some setup process, you will land to this page. And from here, select an option called Move Data from Android. After that, tap on Continue. On your Android phone, open up Move to iOS app that you just downloaded. Click Continue. Go through this process. And now, what you have to do is type this code on your Android phone. After that, both your phones will be connected. Alright, next step, from this list, select WhatsApp which is at the very bottom. Click on start. Once the transferring process is completed, you will see this message on both of your devices. Now on your iPhone, just tap on this uh, blue button. Next, sign in to your iPhone with your Apple ID. This is very important. Alright, after setting up your iPhone, just swipe up and go to second page and there you will see a WhatsApp. So just tap on it and tap on view in app store and download the WhatsApp on your iPhone. After downloading the WhatsApp, open it and verify your account. After that, click on start and give the required permissions and wait for your WhatsApp messages to be transferred from your Android phone. Once it's done, click on next, type your name and then all your WhatsApp messages should be transferred from your Android phone. So yeah, that's how the first method works. Now let me show you the second method. Our second method is using a software for transferring WhatsApp from Android to iPhone. For this method to work, you need a Windows or a Mac computer. And also, you don't have to erase your iPhone or update it. This method works with all the models of Android and iOS devices and it doesn't matter whatever version they are running on. So now let me show you how this method works. In order to transfer WhatsApp using the second method, first of all, go to the link in the description below and download the software. The software is called Tenushare iCareFone Transfer. 
Again, I will leave the link of the software in the video description below so you can get it from there. And this software is also available for Mac users. After installing the software into your computer, just open it up. With the software, you can also transfer your WhatsApp business messages. So in my case, I am going to transfer my regular WhatsApp messages. So I am going to go with the first option. Now you need to connect both your phones to your computer using your USB cable. Once your phones are connected to your computer, this software will automatically detect them. As you can see on the left side you have the source phone. Now this is the phone that will transfer the WhatsApp messages and the destination phone will receive the WhatsApp messages. So in my case I am going to transfer WhatsApp from my Android phone to iPhone. So I am going to click on this button to switch to order. Alright after that click on transfer option. Click on continue. Next you have to backup WhatsApp messages on your Android device. In order to backup your WhatsApp messages, first of all open up WhatsApp and go to these three dots and go to settings, select chats and scroll all the way down, select chat backup, after that select backup to Google Drive and make sure it's set to never. After that click on backup, that is all you have to do on your Android device. After backing up WhatsApp messages from your Android phone. Now click on continue on your computer. The next step is to verify your WhatsApp account. You can either verify your account using an encryption key which is not recommended. And the second option is verifying your account with your phone number. So in my case I am going to verify my account with my phone number. After verifying your account now select the type of files that you want to transfer to your iPhone along with your WhatsApp messages. So in my case, I am going to select everything. After that, click continue. Next, log in to WhatsApp on your iPhone. In order to verify your WhatsApp account on iPhone, just open it and click on agree and continue and type the number that you used on your Android phone. After verifying your account, you will land to this page. Just leave your iPhone as it is. Don't touch anything. After verifying your account, click logged in on your computer and wait for your WhatsApp messages to be transferred. Alright, now let's see. Open WhatsApp, click on OK. If you come to this page, just click on Skip Restore and then type your name. After that, all your WhatsApp messages should be transferred from your Android phone to your iPhone. Alright, before I say goodbye to you guys, there is something that you should know about the software that I used in this method. The software I use in this method is not 100% free. With free version of the software, you will have some limitations. But if you want to unlock full feature, then you have to purchase it. But the question is, would you purchase the software to get your job done? Let me know your answers in the comment section below. I would love to hear them. So there you have it guys. That is how you can transfer WhatsApp messages from Android to iPhone using these two methods. Please let me know which one of these methods you are going to try or you have already tried. Let me know your experience in the comment section below. And also if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and also share it with your friends. And if you want more videos like this in the future, then please subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell. And I will catch you on the next one. Stay blessed. Stay safe. Peace.